Hey friends, thanks so much for joining me. Today I'm going to be kitting up this diamond painting. So I didn't do an unboxing on my channel, I meant to, and then I was like, you know what, I want to start it, and I don't want to film an unboxing because it's not really a good time for that because it's nighttime and I don't have very good light. So I figured that I would do a time lapse of me kitting up, and I'm so excited because this arrived today, so it's the Doris Elizabeth Ward tray. My friend Corrine actually bought this for me, so she had like a question with her website, and I helped her, or with her client's website, and I helped her with it, and she's like, shoot me your Amazon wish list, and I was like, okay. <laughs> so this was on my Amazon wish list, and this is what she got me in exchange for helping her. It literally took me like five minutes to figure out what the problem was, and it was something that her and her team were looking at for um like overnight like the day before they've been trying like since the day before they were trying to figure out what was wrong with this website um and i just figured it out in five minutes so that was good work five minutes of work got me this elizabeth ward container i'm super excited it's so nice and shiny and fancy i'm going to use this to kit up my peaceful evening and the artist is Liam Kelly and it's from Dreamer Designs as you would have seen from the box here are the drills I don't know how I'm going to go about kitting this up because I don't know how much each container really holds or how many drills each container holds and yeah but you can watch so here I go I'm gonna do a time lapse and you can see me get confused okay
they turned out. And as you can see, I have a bunch of extra containers left over, which is fine. Surprisingly, I thought that I would, this was going to be more colors, but it wasn't. So the one thing that I can say is, because this is my first Dreamer Designs kit that I'm kidding up, one thing I can say is that I wasn't too happy with the stickers themselves. Like you can see, I peeled this off. I believe I peeled this off another container because it was too small and I want to transfer it to a bigger container. But when I peeled it off, it left like that white backing residue. So they're not removable stickers. They seem to be permanent stickers. So what that means is after I rip off all the stickers after I'm done with this diamond painting, I'm going to have to use alcohol to rub off the stickers. But I mean, it's not that big of a deal. It's just annoying. Whereas with other companies, when you are done, you just peel off the sticker and it doesn't leave any residue, but whatever. So this is how my kit will be from now on. I'm going to always put the title up here so I know what I'm kidding up. And then here's all the drills. I tried to put them in order, but as you can see, there are, some of them are not in order. And some of them are loose and usually when there's like one or two loose I don't really care I just throw them away or I put them on in a little pile on my desk but as you can see I'm ready now to start on my canvas so I will see you guys in my next video if you're new here please consider subscribing I like to call you guys my hive get it momo bee hive oh my god so cheesy but join the hive by subscribing Hit the like button if this video was helpful or entertaining or satisfying to you. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye!